Hello, hello to all the motor sport fans out there. I'm back again with another one, and I want to talk about the 2024 Canadian Grand Prix. So, um, the 2024 Canadian Grand Prix, the weekend was really, really, you know, um, it was raining all weekend. So, we knew the weather was going to throw like a spanner in the works. So, it was looking to be a competitive weekend. So, um, after qualifying, you know, George Russell put it on pole position with um, Max Verstappen lining up next to him on the front row. Then you got the two McLarens, then, yeah, Alonso Hamilton. So now um, the race was wet, yeah, so most of the drivers started on inters and, you know, just like two drivers started on wets, but the rest of them started on inters. The two horses of Magnussen and Hulkenberg started on wets. So um, Russell, uh, he got off very well, he took the lead and him taking the lead, he kept the lead for a while, for a little while until, you know, um, the track, you know, started to dry up slowly. So they, with the track drying up slowly, um, the teams had to make a decision, you know. So on lap eight, you know, Kevin Magnussen came in first, he switched from wet tires to intermediates. So, you know, Haas F1, they realized that, um, they realized that the wet tires was the wrong option. You know, they were hoping for more rain. So on lap 20, you know, um, the, the McLarens start gaining pace. The McLaren of Lando Norris overtook Max Verstappen into the final chicane to take second position, you know, so... Lando was gaining pace, you know, on lap 20. I don't know why the McLaren switched on so so great, you know, in the when the track was getting a little bit drier. On lap 21, he overtook um, George Russell as well to take the lead of the race. And George made a mistake into the final chicane and Max took um, second position from George Russell. So uh, moving on, on lap 25, you had um, Logan Sargent. You know, he spun on um, one of the chicanes, you know, I think turn five or six. So that brought out the safety car and then a lot of drivers pitted, you know. A lot of drivers pitted and, you know, Max and uh, Russell, they had a little battle in the pit lane, you know. <laughs> had a little battle in the pit lane for the lead, but uh, Max came out just slightly ahead of um, George Russell and, yeah. The only thing is, uh, cause Lando Norris um delayed, cause Lando Norris delayed uh, his pit stop by one extra lap. He dropped back to third, you know. So uh, Max Verstappen assumed the lead, you know, on lap twenty nine after the safety car went in, and and so yeah, it was a seventy lap race. So on lap twenty nine, you know, you got Max Verstappen reassuming the lead. So there's been uh two lead changes you had Russell lead and then Verstappen overtook uh Verstappen overtook him and sorry and then you had um London Norris overtaking uh, him and then yeah Verstappen is back in the lead so you have two lead changes so um on lap 45 on lap 45 you know, the crossover was there and then the, the teams decided to switch to the dry tires so on lap 45 Max Verstappen came into the pits, you know, for um, dry tires. So him coming in the pits for dry tires. And then um, Lando Norris came in as well for dry tires. Um, he, uh, uh, he put on the mediums and then Verstappen put on the mediums as well. But um, surprisingly, George Russell, he went for the hard tires. And it was a battle between uh, Verstappen and Norris because Norris pitted one lap after. Verstappen um, came into the first turn and he's, you know, he managed to, you know, take the place of Norris because Norris was just coming out of the pits and his tyres was not warm and Verstappen was at full race pace. So on lap 40, 48, you know, Verstappen um, took the lead, you know, after um, coming in the pits for dry tyres. Then um, you had uh, Lando Norris and George Russell, you know, on lap 49. They were battling it out for second position. And you had, because um, Norris just came out of the pits as well, his tyres was not warm. So he lost the position to George Russell, you know. 
but um, he managed to retake the position two laps later on lap 51 so um with tw with like um 19 laps to go you had um verstappen norris and russell so russell made a little couple of mistakes here and there you know um but yeah um in the end it was um max verstappen he managed to um keep keep the race lead you know and and one thing i remember as well you know the two ferraris they had to retire you know they had to retire the cars you know and from the previous week when they done really really well they had to retire the car and yeah um there was was yeah the ferrari spun as well i think the ferrari of carlos Sainz. yeah there was a lot of you know incidents here yeah, you know um and even uh Sergio Perez was um, noted for unsafe release and things like that. So yeah, peeps, in the end, it was a battle for the victory. You know, the 2024 Canadian Grand Prix did not disappoint. It was a battle for the victory and Max Verstappen took, um, I think, his 60th Formula 1 Grand Prix victory. And yeah, don't forget to subscribe, like, comment and share. And uh, I'm on to the next one. Bless up.